So the second race then is a mile and a quarter for three odds and upwards this time, and the top one is Aladdin's Cove for Hems in Costa Rabat for John, Foot Soldier for Leon van Rensburg, Flinty Bay for Graham Clutterbock, Al Fusi for Alex Cherry, La Dama for Darren Howes, High Garden for Leon van Rensburg, Grey Pearl for Martin Lidham, Love the West for Obi Wan, Novi Sad Swell for Vinnie Gerard, Question Answered for Hems, Sacred Chick for Martin Lidham, or Sacred Chic, Novi Sad Number for Vinnie Gerard, Mabs Cross for Darren Thompson, Clustra Aries for Davy Ladd, Adventure for Joshua Sullivan, Winter Queen Paul O'Neill, Petronas Towers and Tomahawk Tina for Paul Rhodes and Al Nawibi for Shadwell. They're all installed then and away they go. Pretty close up. Look at them there. Grey Pearl closest to us who isn't a grey. Interesting. And the leader is Adventure right over on the far side pulling for its head. Got the rail and is going to take this turn in the lead from the grey. Love the West who's come across into second place. Then comes Claustra Aries in third. On the inside of that one is Mabs Cross. Al Fuzzi on the outside with the orange sleeves and a bit of a gap to Encosta about. He's on the inside of Patronus Towers. Flinty Bay is also in that group. You can see the pink cap bobbing up and down of Question Answered. And behind that one Tomahawk Tina with the purple jacketed Sacred Sheik just after that one. And right over there on the inside is uh, Alna Weeby and looking towards the back, Grey Pearl. The second of the purple jacketed horses is the back marker, but it's Adventure that's got the lead. And as they're already down towards the six furlong pole, then Adventure's got the lead from Claustra Aries in second. Mabs Cross is there in third. Love the West, the Grey is still close up in fourth. And Al Fusi, Novi Sad Swell in the green jacket closest to us. Just behind that one is Flinty Bay. Well, making a forward move on the inside is in Costa Abed. The question answered with the pink cap is still there as well. They're almost split into two packs there. The leading pack are a good two lengths clear of the chasing pack who are just about headed by Al Nawabi. But it's Adventure who's in the lead on the inside from Claustra Aries in second. Then comes the two greys there, Love the West and Mabs Cross. Then after that one in Costa about Flinty Bay. Questions answered, going to need some racing room there. Jockey looks like he's got a double handful, but has he got the gap to go through? It's Adventure in the lead from Claustra Aries. Mabs Cross now throws down a big challenge and gets to within three parts of a length of the leader as they pass the two furlong pole. It's Adventure in the lead from Mabs Cross. Here comes Patronus Towers on the outside. Then Claustra Aries, Tomahawk Tinas after that one. Also trying to again is a cluster about but it's Petronas Towers who's got into the lead as they hit the furlong pole Petronas Towers on the in just about in the lead but on the outside Claustra Aries is coming through and now in Costa about sweeps through as well also finishing well is Arna Weeby but it's in Costa about that swept into the lead and up the post it's in Costa about the wins it Arna Weeby is second Claustra Aries was third then Petronas Towers Mabs Cross Tomahawk Tina High Garden Grey Pearl after that one Sacred Sheep was probably last and complexion of the race changed in the final furlong Adventure got run out of it completely, and in Costa a bet has taken it, and that's a quick fire double, isn't it, for John Morgan? So, I presume it's John Morgan anyway, it might not be, of course, it's John anyway, and he's won the first two trials races. So, in Costa about the winner for John, second place was Al Noibi, he was right out the back early on for Shadwell. If the card goes back up again, I'll remember who was third and fourth, hopefully. And we can see there it was Claustra Aries for David, David Robertson, I think, and Patronus Towers for Paul Rhodes was fourth. <laughs>